I am Dr. Piyush Goel. I am a pulmonologist and a critical care specialist in Manipal Hospital Gurugram. Today, I will discuss about some of the common myths and associated facts regarding tuberculosis. First myth is TB is a genetic disease. This is not right. TB is uh, always a infectious disease. It is not genetic. Yes, in some patients, it can be like a latent TB infection, which is which become an active disease as your immunity goes down. Number two myth: TB only occurs in lungs. This is not right. TB can happen in any part of your body. It can happen in your abdomen. It can happen in your bones. It can happen in your skin. It can affect your eyes. It can affect your brain system, CNS system. It can affect every part of your body. Number three myth: all TB patients are infectious. This is also not right. Every TB patient is not infectious. Patients who have lung TB are the only patients who are infectious. Otherwise, the patients who have TB of other organs are these people are not infectious. Number four myth: whenever TB patient is coughing in front of me, I will get a TB infection. This is not. Not right. TB in TB disease will happen only in those patients who are in a very close contact for a very longer time of duration. Then only TB will happen in a in those patients. It is not like whenever the patient coughs, you can get a TB. Then the myth is TB patients is are only. TB happens only in patients who are smokers. This is also not right. Yes, smokers can have can have high chances of getting TB, but it happens only in smokers. This is not right. Then the myth is, uh, how can I get a TB as I live and work in a very hygienic environment? This is also not right. Hygienic environment of work and living is not the criteria that you will not get a TB. TB is TB happens in some patients. TB is detected in some patients in view of the immunity levels of your body. If your immunity levels are down. If your immunity is not up to the mark, it can be because of many reasons. It can be because of stress. It can be because of drugs you take, which suppresses your immunity. It can be because of underlying diseases. It can happen in transplant patients. It can happen in cancer patients. It can happen in chronic organ diseases. But it is not right that hygiene is associated with a TB. Then there is a myth that TB always happens in underprivileged people and class. This is also not right. As I told you, a TB patient have a decreased immunity. They have their immunity is not good. Then only they will get a tuberculosis. So by no means it is associated with underprivileged class. So these are the common myths which I want. to discuss with you and i just want to give you facts regarding that thank you